If you have heard some rumors about Pyramiden that it is a ghost town, one of the ghosts is talking to you right now, is standing right in front of you. Pyramiden is a very special place. Once it was a dream that God fulfilled. So there was nothing here, just rocks and ice. They built some kind of Athlone society. So kind of heaven on earth. They did have everything they needed. They came with families and they just lived their lives. They worked really hard and they enjoyed being here. That's why for most of them it was very sad when this story ended. My name is Kirill Shevlev, I'm Russian from Moscow region. I work here as interpreter and guide. So I pretty like it here. I pretty like this work. I can enjoy my solitude to be on my own with my thoughts and just experience myself. Pyramiden was a unique place because instead of being closed like the whole Soviet Union for foreigners and for different kind of visitors, Permiden was all the time opened for all visitors, first of all from abroad, like Japan, USA, Germany, so they were all welcomed here. All the idea about this place, not just this place, but Soviet Union in general, it was like competition. They were a building for future. This was some kind of socialistic experiment here because it was created some special society with some special laws, rules, obligations. It was a really special place to show the West all the advantages of the Soviet Union like a lot of services that were free of charge. For example, the locals got satellite TV even before Norwegians did. So there were plenty of things that Russians were eager to show. They didn't want those people from all over the world to be afraid of them. They wanted to be friends. They even had that slogan, Miru Mir, that means peace to the world. So we can say that it was a successful experiment. There is something different now, and it's okay, because I have a part, some part here that I can play.